Hey everybody, Alan Peterson here, and I want to show this uh, cool tool that I've been using uh, recently called Cold Turkey. And uh, they have uh, he, this guy Felix has some pretty cool uh, products, and the one that I've really been uh, enjoying here is uh, called uh, Micromanager. And it's I'm going to walk you through this, and basically what it does it lets you whitelist uh, apps on your computer, software programs, Windows, and uh, and blocks everything else. Uh, so for example, I use it to allow me to just only use Scrivener and that which is what I use to write my books. And that way I can focus on writing and everything else is blocked. So let me show it to you here in action. So um, here is, um, got my Chrome browser and I have YouTube channels here and Facebook. I also opened up a podcast here that I've been uh, listening to and you know, different distractions um, that you can have. And so, um, so let's say now I want to get some writing done and I don't have the willpower <laughs> and I hate to admit that, but it's, the, it's the fact, I just so easy to get distracted here with messages and everything. So anyway, so, um, I want to write, so I have my Scrivener, uh, open here. And so, uh, what I'll do is I'll open up uh, the uh, micro manager and, uh, let me show that to you in here in action. So. And it says right here, Micromanager will only allow you to use whitelisted applications for a period of time. Please make sure the applications you want to use are open. So you want to make sure it's open. Uh, so click on the button here. And so here's all the applications that I have open. I have the Chrome, my browser, uh, the podcast app, uh, Messenger, uh, messages. So anyway, and um, the only one I want to be able to access here is Scrivener. So I'll click on that and click on next. And so uh, here is, uh, you can either set up a computer timer, a countdown timer, or a compu computer restart. The computer restart is a little hardcore for me because basically you'll have to restart your computer to, to uh, be able to access your other um, uh, Windows and software apps on your computer. So that's a little too hardcore for me. So I, I just use the countdown timer and you can set it up for ho however long you want. For this uh, example, I'm gonna set it for one minute. Click on next. Uh, duration is no breaks. Uh, okay, so Micromanager is free. You download it for free um, and you'll have no breaks. These other uh, features, the allowance and the, and the Pomodoro timer, which are awesome, are for if you paid for the upgrade. And so the, for, if you pay for the upgrade, you have access to the allowance, which lets you uh, access other applications. And then this is the one that I've been using is the uh, Pomodoro timer. So basically, let's say, for example, after working 30 minutes, you can allow access for other applications for 15 minutes. So that way, for 30 minutes, I'm, I can only access uh, Scrivener. And then after that, uh, as a reward for 15 minutes, I can access, I can go to Facebook or whatever. So I really like these two features. And the nice thing about the Micro Manager is the price. It's just $19. So it's free for no breaks. If you want to have the uh, Pomodoro timer and the allowance, and uh, you pay 19 bucks, And it's uh, for... And it's one-time fee. It's not a subscription base, which I hate. So it's 19 bucks, and uh, so it's awesome. But anyway, okay. So let's uh, for the, for this example, I'm just going to use the no breaks. Uh, I set it up for a minute. So let's just go with no breaks. Click next, and so here we go. It says here you'll only be able to use a Scrivener for one minute with no breaks. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and click start, and boom. As you can see, everything uh, on my computer has gone away. And uh, the only thing I can access now, so let's say I'm gonna go Google Chrome. As you can see, it won't let me open it. It like pops up and it goes away. <laughs> Same thing with a podcast. Let's say I wanna listen to that podcast. Nope, I can't access it no matter how many times I click on it. It's not gonna happen. Uh, so the only thing I can have access to is Scrivener. So click on that and boom, there we go. Here's Scrivener. I can go ahead and write my, right away for as long as this lasts and you know, if I want to go to Google, nope. All I can access is uh, is uh, Scrivener, and so this uh, works uh, pretty sweet. Uh, you have other options here too. You can show notifications after your block, uh, things like that. Um, but uh, let me show you then uh, what happens once it runs out. I've got three seconds left here, and okay, so it's over. So now I can go and now I can go. To, my Chrome will open up. I can go back to the podcasts what have you.
So as you can see, this is a really cool feature. And if you want to start a new session, then you just click start new session and you go through it again and set everything up again. So anyway, uh, this is really cool. Um, highly recommend this uh, tool. It's, it's really, really lets me uh, focus on just writing. I do recommend, I mean, if you, if you like to use the Pomodoro timer, um, which I like to use uh, for $19 is what the software costs. I think it's worth every penny. Um, it's really a uh, cool uh, software and so you can go get it at the goal at the get cold turkey dot com uh, for slash micromanagers for this one uh, but he has other f features as well he's got a, a blocker and this writer uh, writing script but no, the one I've been using is a micromanager is the one that I'm showing you here and that's the one that uh, I'm highly recommending so anyway so that's it the cool tool to uh, really uh, get some writing done uh, and just I want to share that with you.